Welcome back to Growing with Glenna. How do you prepare for a wedding and it not cost you thousands and thousands of dollars? Brides Magazine said that the average cost of a floral arrangement for a reception is between $120 and $600. This low arrangement for the reception costs $12. And I'm going to take you through step by step. Here are the supplies you need. You'll need some type of container. I chose a wooden container because I just like the look of it. And this one is approximately 12 inches by five by four. You'll also need some foam. This is dry foam. You'll also need some moss. You'll need primary flowers, some gypsophila in one color because the primary color for this wedding is pale pink. I chose a slightly darker gypsophila. We need some white gypsophila. You can use a different type of flower if you'd like. Some foliage to provide for the pale pink color of this wedding. I chose pale pink sweetheart roses and white sweetheart roses. Again, these were 40% off at Hobby Lobby. I would suggest that you have wire cutters, 22 gauge wire, floral tape, scissors, and stem wire. Measure for more exacting. A clear ruler is always handy. For these tables, we decided on one longer arrangement that would go in the middle of approximately 10 people. I ordered my boxes from Michaels. The next item you're going to need is for step one is a dry foam floral brick. And I'm going to mark mine simply by taking and measuring the inside and then rubbing it along. Serrated edges work really well to cut your floral foam bricks. You want floral foam on every single inch of your container because you will need to be placing your flowers in the floral brick. For step two, you're going to need some moss. I'm using the moss to cover the floral brick so that I do not have to cover every single inch and it will still look nice. For the next step, we're going to need some lilies. Initially, I tried to use just one stem of the lily because each of the stems regularly is $8.99. But Hobby Lobby puts these florals and wedding supplies on sale every other week for 40% off. Go when it's 40% off. So these, I used three and that's the rule of threes three just looks more interesting real nature is not symmetrical so when you're making the rule of threes then you're making a more interesting floral arrangement so i want to be cutting as close to the stem as possible there's one I also ended up using the buds for interest and I'll be cutting that off as well. One more here. I'm feeling it in that dry foam and one here. 
And the last one. It's there. Now for step four. I decided to go with one on each side. Now, let's place our goods. I'm pushing this one pretty much down to the bottom so that there is a difference in height. Next, I'm going to place the pink rose buds. Now let's add our white roses. For the ends, I'm placing this one As I add the rest of the flaps, I'll speed it up, slow it down if you need to. There you have it, a low arrangement. If you like what you saw, then be sure and subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.